Hello. I just wanted to show you my old home theater setup. This is an eight year old, eight years old um, setup. I started my my home theater back in 2004. I started with the two speakers with monitor audio, audio monitor, audio um, uh, loudspeaker, and it's a pretty good speaker. It's pretty decent. It has a, it has a very deep bass and nice clarity of the treble. And <clears throat> this is the and also a 2004 subwoofer. It's the MTX audio model. It's one of their smallest subwoofer, but it also has a very deep bass. It works for a smaller room. And I have is the 1995 Boston Acoustic Center Channel Speaker. This is a very old speaker, but it works very, it works pretty good. The sound and the, the dialogue is very clear. As long that you have a uh, nice subwoofer to support it, it does the job. Now, the one that powers these speakers are the VSX-32 model Pioneer Elite. I got this receiver back in 2000 and 2009. It has a THX certified with Dolby Digital True HD and a DTX HD. So it has a 1080p pass through. I have an old Wii console with the Xbox 360 and the first generation PS3. I use this PS3 for Blu-ray uh, movies. It's one of the fastest Blu-ray player you ever uh, own. If you <clears throat> if you like to play some um, some Blu-ray play uh, Blu-ray movies, this is the fastest player. And I have the cable box. Now this TV is. is one of the top of the line LCD the last LCD that came out of Samsung back in 2009 the color the brightness I can compare this TV to a a newer 4k uh, TCL or a 6 series Samsung and it, it's still clear still the the clarity is still crisp the brightness you can't beat the brightness of this LCD so this is my this is my home theater setup this setup has been with me for so many years and I still love them I might upgrade for a new TV. I'm looking at a the new OLED um, LG or the Sony LG that they have. Uh, Sony OLED, I'm sorry, or a Samsung Q9 65 inches. This is a 55 inches, by the way. It's perfect for a smaller room if you have a smaller apartment so it's pretty good